Week two, Breastplate of Righteousness. And our text is Ephesians 6, 14 and 2 Corinthians 5, 21. The word righteousness or dikaiosune refers to a character or quality of being right or just. It is used to denote an attribute of God. The Bible says in 2 Corinthians 5.21 that, For he hath made him to be sin for us, who knew no sin, that we might be made the righteousness of God in him. Meaning that believers, people who are born again, are the righteousness of God in Jesus Christ. But righteousness is an attribute of God. Does this mean that man could be righteous? Based on what Jesus did for us on the cross, the answer is yes. Hence the verse in 2 Corinthians 5.21. Righteousness is that gracious gift of God to men whereby all who believe on the Lord Jesus Christ are brought into right relationship with God. This righteousness is unattainable by obedience to any law or by any merit of man's own or any other condition other than that of faith in Christ. Ephesians 6.14 says, having on the breastplate of righteousness, which is something we are to have on at all times. The devil attacks our heart or the center of our emotions, self-worth and trust. The breastplate of righteousness protects our heart and assures us of God's approval for us. The same word for righteous, the Kayasune is used in Ephesians 6.14, where the Apostle Paul is referring to righteousness as right action or behavior. Therefore, we are to behave righteously, that is, doing the right thing according to God's word. Do note, right acts on the part of man do not make him righteous, but faith in God. However, we are required to act in a righteous manner. We must remember that this is not a fight against flesh and blood and that as children of God, we are victorious in battle. It may seem that being and behaving righteous is a huge expectation. However, we are not strong in ourselves, but in the Lord and in the power of his might, Ephesians 6.10. We are not using our armor, but God's armor, Ephesians 6 11, we are not righteous in our doing, but we are the righteousness of God, 2 Corinthians 5 21. So let's make sure we have our breastplate of righteousness on and ready for our victory through Jesus Christ. Family application. When the enemy comes in to make you feel like you're not good enough or not worthy, or you have done too many wrong things, you must not think, but know that you were approved by God. If you make a mistake, go boldly before his throne of grace and receive your forgiveness and move on. This is not the time to give up on your walk with God. He has equipped you with everything you need to live a victorious life every day. So keep trusting him. So for the family discussion, before we get into the question, you know, sometimes righteousness feels like a tall order of the day. It's like a lot to ask to be righteous but yeah. we have to remember that we are the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus mm -hmm. it's not anything we could earn but it's by the grace of God yeah. and as humans we are emotional people we're emotional people hence the enemy affects our emotions our feelings of self-worth you know or if you mess up you know you're not good enough all of that and we have to remember that it's always about God let's get into the question what does trying to live right or righteousness have to do with this spiritual battle and give examples okay so you were talking about us being emotional people right yeah. so the devil starts attacking us he starts by using our emotions correct yeah and so we may begin to feel as though we're losing trust in God we may begin to feel um, like if we should just give up right so we might stop serving God or we might even begin to feel as though we're not children of God and we might start praying yeah as though God is angry to us so angry with us so we may not even pray so whatever lie that the enemy may put out that Jesus is mad at us and that he, he may need to be pacified 
is a lie. It is a lie. Yeah. God is not mad at us. He loves us. Exactly. He has approved us. He sent his son to die on the cross for our sins. He has made us righteous through that action. And he has made us his children and his heirs to, to his kingdom. Yeah, hence we have on the breastplate of righteousness to protect the core of our emotions. So it's not about righteous behavior to make us the righteousness of God. It's our faith, but we have to behave righteously. So some of the examples that we came up with and what it has to do with battle. When we don't behave righteously, it allows sin in our lives. And we have to understand that we are the righteousness of God and we have to act righteously and not have kinks or holes in our breastplate, so to speak, yeah. where the enemy could come in. Mm -hmm. So one of the examples is that the scale people tend to think you know if i do enough good acts i'll be okay if it's more than the bad acts it's not a scale mm -hmm. and then what happens when you when if you make a mistake it could go any scale exact points exactly yeah. because you people become grossly disappointed in themselves and again want to give up because you yeah. made this such a mistake because you're doing it against good acts and bad acts yeah. and that's not how it goes we cannot beat up on ourselves when we do something wrong worse yet beat up on other people we have to be there to support people right acts we we start a measure sin big sin small sin sin is sin and you sin can't rationalize sin. sin if you're measuring it then okay. if someone who you you hold in high esteem does something wrong you might think it's okay to do it too because again it's it's on the scale of what is good and what is bad still sin yeah because when yeah. we base things on works it removes god and his grace correct but we have to know we are the righteousness of god and we act righteously and we look to him for everything yeah so these these things are again are self-imposed it has nothing to do with what god has said sometimes you know if you refuse to go to a particular event people might think okay well she thinks she's too good or she's too perfect to go to it and that has nothing and you you attend in order to avoid conflict mm. and the psalm 1 1 blessed is a man that walks not in the counsel of the ungodly where did we forget that mm. and you don't have to be ruder. We don't have to be rude. Respectfully decline. And a, a good... Um, and don't lie. <laughs> don't be like, oh, well, I have something else to do. I yeah. mean, it's not hard to simply say, I don't do this. Yes. Yeah. That's it. And that's the thing. Draw the line. Yeah. Early. Have a boundary. Yeah. Yeah. Have good habits. Yes. So that they would know. Yeah. Yeah. Another one is trying to fit in with people. Things are very exclusive these days. Everything is exclusive. And... People's desire to be part of these groups and cliques could be very dangerous. A lot of the behavior in these groups, it's not pleasing in the sight of God. And we just have to exclude ourselves from it because it's not what we do. It's not the right thing. And the final point that we have, a final example, is that we have to know that righteousness is not a show. Because if we pretend, so, if, if it's a pretense, you might fool other people, you might even fool yourself, but you're not fooling God. So if you don't have genuine <laughs> righteousness, you're not wearing a breastplate, right? Exactly, you have holes in your breastplate now. <laughs> right. It's, 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 it, it might seem like a big request, but it's not difficult when we develop in doing these things. And you know, we run with patience, the race that is set before you. Mm -hmm. And we live by the grace of God every day. That's why God said, but God will tell us to do something we can't do. Correct. He wouldn't do, tell us to do something he didn't give us the grace to do. So we have to be aware of it and keep it all. It has nothing to do with what people think. Mm -hmm. People cannot be the measure on what is right in the world. It is based on God and God will give us his strength. So let's keep our breastplate on. Yes.